wool socks. Yeah, July 25th, wool socks. Shouldn't be at it. Shouldn't even be allowed. But anyway, I swore I wasn't going to complain about the weather, right? Like, but like, you can't help it. And I didn't want to say anything because I didn't want to draw any attention to myself or nothing like that because, you know, the RNC would be at my door next thing. Yeah, see the boys getting arrested? I laughed and laughed and laughed a bit. Yeah, like, you know, like they had something to do with it. Who knows, maybe they did. They're not even from here. Maybe it's a big conspiracy. I don't know. I don't know. I don't even know whose who's fault it is. I really feel bad for anybody who's visiting our province for the first time. Because it's not usually like this. You know, I saw a youngster today in Dominion with a parka on him. No joke. Fur collar and everything. Yeah, like, and she probably needs it. She's probably here from out of town somewhere and, like, froze to death. Right? But, anyway, could be worse. We could have tornadoes or hurricanes or something like that. So it feels compla like bad complaining about a bit cold. Right? But what I find is that, like, you just can't get out and enjoy it like summer like you normally can. And this is the first summer I've been off now forever. And, uh, look what I'm at. Stuck inside. Like, you can't go up to the beach or anything like that, or like, you know, you don't feel like taking a day trip when you're stuck inside. Like, I don't want to go to the mall. Only so much you can see when you got ten stores. Right? Like, so, what do you do? Today, guess what I did? Went to the Mary March Museum. Yeah, first time I was ever there in a long time, like probably in 20-something years. Yeah, so, like, a lot has changed. Like, I thought they got them done right up, right nice. Like, they got a lot of the same old stuff that they had there years ago. Like, you know, like the geography and the native, um, plants and native peoples and, and the native animals of our area. Like, but I forgot a lot of it. Yeah, like, like, you know, stuff that you learn in Newfoundland culture. Remember Newfoundland culture? Everybody, every teenager, I don't even know if they still got it. I wonder if they do. Like, but a lot of, like, when you were a teenager in high school, you had to take a course in Newfoundland culture. Yeah, and, um, I don't remember anything. No, like, I wish I did. Like, but, um, the only thing I remember is about Newfoundland culture is that we had Mr. Melvin, and, uh, one of boys in our class kept asking about skidoos. Yeah, like, he was like, did the boys give skidoos? Right? Like a real tool, right? And, uh, but he was only doing it just to get a laugh at everybody, right? Well, how come they had to build canoes? Didn't they just take the canoe? How come they couldn't take the quad? Right? Stuff like that. That's all I remember about Newfoundland culture. So I can tell you that the other people never had a quad. Yeah. But, like, anyway, so it was interesting, right? Lots of stuff I forgot. So, you know, it is good to refresh your memory. And, uh, now, like, they got this new area. Yeah, they run by the rooms. And anyway, it's like, as uh, a traveling exhibit. Like, they got change, it changes all the time. Like, right now, they got one on carnivorous plants. Yeah, so, like, you know, they had all kinds of different plants. Now they traps, their prey, and stuff like that. And did you know that the pitcher plant is a carnivorous plant? Yeah, imagine! Like, leave it to my Labrador to have a provincial plant that I eat, yeah? Yeah, anyway, uh, you know, people don't expect that of us, but anyway, it was fun. It was funny, I never ever knew. Yeah, it's very slippery or something, and then, like, they, like, a fly will come by and think there's getting some nectar and stuff like that, and they slide right down the middle of the plant. Yeah, that's why it's called a pitcher plant, because it's shaped like a pitcher. And anyway, it's all filled like a goo and stuff like that, and the fly goes right down and gets stuck in it. Yeah, and the plant eats it. Yeah, imagine. Anyway, stuff you learns. Yeah, but, and guess how much it costs to get into the Mary Match Museum? Kids 18 and under is free, and adults are 225. No, 250. So extra 25 cents. Right? Imagine! We're cheap! Anyway, it's fun to, you know, kill the afternoon there. Right? So, anyway, looking for more stuff to do. Anyone got any good ideas? What are you doing now that the weather's bad? What are you doing with your youngsters? Right? A pity's all ye. Anyway. Hope you're having an alright summer. Yeah, relax. And soak it up. You know, it could be worse. We could live in worse places. Anyway, have a good weekend. Bye.